Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to build a blue tongue lizard enclosure. Uh, first off, you'll be seeing, seeing eat, eating here. Um, so basically, what you want to do is just uh, take out everything. Um, the substrate, the hides, um, and just take it all out. But since I didn't have enough substrate, I had to just pick most of the stuff out, like his leftover food or his poo or that I didn't that I missed, I didn't clean up. Um, yeah, so that's basically it. Um, the reason blue tongues are lizard to search such good plants is that they um they they're happy with they eat anything basically and all you have to do for their enclosure is basically just give them some substrate, a big log and water and food bowl and and they're happy. Um so what I'm doing now is you're gonna make wanna make sure that your lizard has enough substrate so that he can bury and hide himself. Um <clears throat> so yeah and um they they love change so if it's just like changing a log or the changes the direction it's put that they're happy like that um see so as you like i change it now because he'll probably like it like that yeah and um so i've got the thermo thermostat on 28 degrees and i've got a ceramic heat light and the uv light at the top and i've just changed it And for the uh, blue tongue lizard's food and water, I've just got it on a stone so it doesn't really get dirty. And a separate dish for like grapes or blueberries so that doesn't get dirty as well.